so 420 something four ouch 30 day seven northwest ontario musky hunt and i'm tired but the forecast for today is hot with no clouds so we're going to have to take advantage of any low light situation we have and it just so happens to be right now um we had some fish moving last night uh so we're going to go back and see if we can capitalize on oh, on that and uh yeah just gotta get out there and get fishing because uh if you stop right now you're gonna fall over uh yeah i don't know let's go see what we can do <laughs> Well, it is day eight, the last day of our Northwest Ontario musky fishing trip here on Eagle Lake, and it has been an Eagle Lake type of bite, and that is a tough one. Um, this is a notoriously tough lake, and uh, it, it proved it to us this week. It was, uh, it was rough going. Saw fewer fish than I usually see, but the fish we did see were... God. There was a couple days there where it seemed like every fish we raised was 50 inches, but uh, yeah, I don't know. Last morning we've got severe storms coming in, um, which may hinder fishing for a while, but we're gonna get out and fish for as long as we can. And uh, I don't know, it may be merciful if storms come in because we can get some sleep, <laughs> and hopefully, those storms get the fish to eat. So Oh boy, well, get the boat ready, head out, and see what we can do. I know. That was weird. Must have been he just heard that fire tiger. Go ahead, that's Jim. The, that's the ultimate kick in the nuts right there. <laughs> that was supposed to be back by Jim, shouldn't it? Yeah, I feel like we just got ratted out. <laughs> I think these muskies have like a whole oh, other one. Are you kidding me? Is she following us? Okay, well, just <laughs> say we're gonna be attacked. Oh, it'd be nice like for it'd be nice for a change. I really don't know what's going on. <laughs> and it's almost like they're checking the boat out. I mean, what are the chances that two of them would have just uh, yeah. randomly on the shoreline would have done that? Hey, these guys have sponsorship. See <laughs> <laughs> company. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, mine are the keeper. Ah! Sixteen three quarters. Oh. Ah, I beat you. Oh. Alright, last afternoon, we got about three and a half hours to make this happen. Uh, we didn't really see a whole lot today. A couple fish. Um, a couple porpoise next to the boat, which is usually not a good sign, but we had a couple follows after that. And then uh, Jamie raised a real nice one. We, we did a little bit of walleye fishing this afternoon, and Jay raised a nice one out on the reef. So we're going to go check her out later. Right now, it's sunny. We're going to fish some weeds, and hopefully the weather holds together. We had some storms today. Hopefully nothing pops up and 
we can fish hard for the last three hours of the trip. <laughs> Underage women. <laughs> Would be nice to you. Yeah. Usually they are. I mean, fish, fish. Ready? I don't know. Oh, jeez. Look how he ate that Medusa. My, that thing is gone. Yeah. Are you kidding me? What's that? Uh, no, that's all right. Look. Hit that okay. button, camera. All right. Look at look at look where that Medusa is, dude. Ryan's ripping a Medusa, and it it is it, it's gone. Gone. Big pike. We were hoping for a muskie, but this pike definitely connected on his target. Holy cow! Look Probably at an this. upper thirty-inch piker. No, no, go ahead. Look, look at this thing. Look how that thing ate that Medusa. Jeez. It's got, it's when got. When they're intended look, to... look at this. Oh, got a little hook in there. Somebody else off. It's a bonus lures. Okay, first one's out. Look at that. <laughs> Extracted. I bet it's only a 35 or 36. <laughs> eh, it, it's like a 35. Oh, man. Yeah. No, just just video. That's fine. That thing crushed that Medusa, and it was gone in its mouth. Yeah. I know. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. If anybody says these baits are too big, they are wrong. All right. Well, that was exciting, but it's the wrong. You know how big birds get eaten. There she goes. All right. Well. Keep ripping. That's ridiculous. That is a lot of bait to disappear in a 35 inch pike's mouth. And now we know what these fish are capable of. Oh yeah. So when they really want to eat something. So yeah, you look at you look at the head of a 50 inch muskie and you look at a monster medusa. That's nothing. Like I said, I think my bucktail was completely gone inside my muskie's mouth. Oh yeah. I knew she started swimming the wrong way on me. <laughs> Darn it. Okay, you got it. Thanks, Brian, for making an awesome call and coming over here. Oh, you're welcome, Jamie. That's quite all right. See how hard I hit that? Yeah. And I hit her twice. <laughs> oh, geez, we almost lost our camera here.
<laughs> I hope this changes things for the next two hours. Yep. Maybe a mid 40, maybe? I think so. It's a nice fish. Right, don't hurt me. Don't, don't hurt me, fish. Don't hurt me. Nice fish, Jim. Let's make the next two hours count. Yep, let's do it, man. Jim's turn. Who knows what's seen a fish yet? <laughs> she wasn't hooked that well. I mean, she was, but she didn't come. She came out. Second. Day eight is done. We are finally packed up. With the truck and the boat packed up. Sort of finished on a strong note. Jamie got a nice 45. We saw some fish tonight, but just could not. Oh, man. This is one of the tougher trips I've ever had here. I mean, Eagle Lake is a notoriously tough lake anyway. And uh, I don't know, I've never seen so many big fish though. It was, it was unreal. For a couple days there, it seemed like every 50 plus inch fish in the lake was moving. But uh, yeah, that's a wrap. I'm coming back in August. And uh, until then though, uh, we get to say goodbye to Canada and back to normal fishing in the States, I guess. So, well, thank you for watching. Uh, if, if you could do us a favor, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. We appreciate every single one of you that watches. And uh, I'm going to go get some sleep. I can't even talk. I'm so tired. Get some sleep because we're getting up early. And, uh, yep, that's a wrap. Bye.